Hi everyone, I've not filmed for about um, 30 40 minutes. As you can see, I'm in my room. Well, hopefully, you can tell this is my room. Um, it is dark because there's no lights on, but there's lights. I mean, it's light outside. I don't know if you can actually see. There you go, it's light still. I think it's something like 10 past 8. Um, I've just been sat here. I've been watching some YouTube stuff. Um, but that's it. I've not done anything else. I really, does this, well, does this necklace I want to buy and these earrings I want to buy? I think the necklace is 129 or 139 if you go. 129 if you want the silver and 139 if you want the gold. And I can't decide between gold and silver. I've been buying bits of gold here and there. Even like costume jewellery, you know, the cheap things like a pair of earrings for three pounds or whatever. And I've been buying the more, like, I've got a watch. I think that one, 90 pounds. I know it's not real gold. But then I've got, if I can get it, this necklace. And this is gold. Hold on. You're probably not even going to be able to see it, but I wear it all the time at the moment. I used to wear it a lot. It won't focus, but this is gold plated, and that was like I think it was 65. I got it for my birthday last year. It was one of my birthday presents, and I wore it a lot then, and then I didn't wear it a lot, and then I've been wearing it probably the last three weeks. That's gold, and I've just been picking up bits and pieces up because I'm not a big gold fan. I've always preferred silver or white gold, and I have quite a few. Well, not quite a few, but I have some white gold. A few pairs of earrings, necklace. I think I've got two white gold necklaces, but I don't have a lot of white gold. I probably have maybe four pairs of earrings, and then I've got a white gold and amethyst and diamond ring as well. But I prefer silver, so the majority of my jewellery, whether it be proper jewellery, well, it's all jewellery, but real silver or just silver coloured but I have a lot of real silver stuff probably just as much as the silver coloured so I just wanted to like get a few you know like gold pieces but I can't decide if I want this necklace in gold or silver I like them both but I do prefer silver but at the same time as I said I'm trying to, like I do have this necklace, it's my only gold necklace. I have a, I have a, a gold, like it's costume jewellery necklace that I never wear. Cause I wore it once, not really keen on it, it's a chunky one. And it was only like 6 99 from New York, I think I'm going to bin it. But I don't have any other gold coloured necklaces that I know of. And it's real gold, obviously at that price. And it's limited edition, so I'm trying to decide if I want gold or silver. But I want to wait till next payday, but next payday is three weeks tomorrow. It seems like forever away. Oh, is it two weeks tomorrow? I don't even know what's going on. No, it's three weeks tomorrow because it's the ninth today. So it'll be the 10th tomorrow. And there's 31 days in August. So it's three more weeks. This is a long month. It's like nearly five weeks in this month, which is just annoying. So, if I wait, there's the risk that, obviously, it might have sold out. It's limited edition. But with limited edition, I don't know how many's been made. And I keep... A lot of the people have it in gold, but I saw someone that I watched on YouTube get it in silver and I'm like oh it's really nice in silver should I get silver and I don't know and then from the same brand there's some earrings and I want two pairs of the same earrings because they're like a small hoop and then they've got um, a star on one dangling off and a moon on the other and on the picture so they don't have to put a lot of pictures on the person's got them both in the same ear 
And I thought that looked really good instead of having one in one and one in the other. So I thought if I get two pairs, I can wear two on each side. Or I could wear them both on one side and just a plain studs in the other one. So then it's a bit mismatch, which is the in thing at the moment. And then, obviously, I don't know if they would really go with the necklace. Because the necklace is horns. It's like that. And it's a horn. You can get the smaller version, which is cheaper. But I want the the large size. And by large, by no means do I mean it, it's gigantic. But it is bigger. So then I think, what is it I want to wear them on at the same time? I need to get them in the same colour. And I don't know if the earrings come in silver, because I've been looking at them in gold. So I need to obviously decide. I mean, the earrings are not limited edition, so there's no rush for them. But I would like them, because I tend to... At the moment, I'm wearing these. You can't see them, but I've actually got white gold earrings in. The kind of diamond shape. I'll see if I can show you without hitting myself. In the face with the camera, but oh, there you go, you can see them. And these are white gold, but I was wearing some really cheap ones. I got a free pack of earrings from Asda, and I probably showed them when I bought um, some clothes to go to that job interview. I bought, I don't know if it was a job interview or for work, I think when I went out to buy some clothes for work when I got the job, I bought a free pack of earrings. There was a round pair that I'd diamonds all the way around and I wore them for two or three weeks solid and then there was two other pairs there was a pair that was hearts and I can't remember what the third pair was because I've not worn them yet so I wore the ones that they were like a circle of diamantes and um, I was looking in the mirror one day and I'm like oh what's this dark mark it turned my ears green the earrings so I took them out not well in since but then it wouldn't come off took a couple of days to get the green off and then I put the heart ones in and they started to do the same after just over a week and I thought if I wear them I can't keep them in and I want earrings that I can keep in if I want so I've not worn the third pair but I can't remember what the third pair were and I'm not too bothered that I can't wear them so I've basically had these ones in since I've had them in over a week so I'm just trying to decide, like, when to get that necklace. I don't know when to get it. And I want the earrings, so... But I want a necklace, because I, I don't have many necklaces. I mean, I've got some costume jewellery. Well, I'm not going to call them costume jewellery. They're just cheaper necklaces, basically. And I've got them, but I just want a really nice necklace and I like this necklace and it's a website where you can get other ones where you can layer them so you can have several necklaces I just can't decide what colour to get and I do feel like silver looks better on me and that's why I've always got silver but I want some gold pieces so I just I don't know what to do part of me wants the silver part of me wants the gold and I don't want to get two of the same so I don't know what to do since seeing the silver on someone I'm like I really like that but I like the gold one it's confusing and then there's the earrings and then if they come in silver I'll be conflicted because I like them in gold because it's star and moon and I just think they look nice in gold but then what as if they look nice in silver it's just opening a can of worms here and I don't, re I don't actually think I've got any real gold earrings. I want to get some gold studs. But I think I'll just get gold studs and then at least I've got some gold studs. And they'll be... Like, I've got some white gold studs. I wonder where they are. They were actually really expensive for what they are. I'm going to look for them because I want to wear them. I want them in my ears. So, I think I'm... <sighs> I'll see if the sun and moon earrings come in silver. But I like them in gold. See, this is going to be the problem. I am a s silver fan. I think I'll just go for silver in the necklace and then I don't know about the earrings, but it's not a rush for the earrings. I just want the necklace and then it's like, do I get the necklace now or wait till payday? And am I going to have enough money this month? Because obviously I've done two hours less 
I think I'm ahead on my hours though because I did extra. I didn't do much extra last week, I'll be honest. I got the five, ten minutes early every day times four and there was a couple of days where I left at five past and ten past and this week I left 25 past. So I just want to make it up so I at least get 16 hours a week. So I need to see what I'm behind hours wise and try and make it up next week, like get the te 10 minutes early, four times, that's 40 minutes, and try and leave at like 10 past, 20 past if I can. If my manager's there, it's difficult. I can get away with five, 10 minutes, but any longer she's like looking at me. But that's what I'm gonna try and do. Do I look like, I better look like crap at this angle, but I might put a filter on, it's blurry anyway. So yeah, I was just like, I wanted to treat myself on payday, but I went out and bought a suit, which I've not worn yet. And then I bought the blouse, I had that blouse on today actually. And I'm, I'm gonna work Friday, cause I'm, obviously, went to work for two hours. I honestly wish I'd stayed, but, cause I didn't go to bed till half one, so I still could have gone to bed at half one. Cause I got home and then I sat around for a bit and I had some food, but, I could have come home and gone to bed, so I, I should have just stayed for the hour and 40 minutes. Because I, I was contemplating it, and then I was like, I just want to go home. But then she's always going to think I'm going to be ill, so I just feel like I can't win with that one. Don't know what else to say. If I can get my hours in, then I will buy that necklace as my treat. I mean, like I said, I bought a suit and then um, I bought some trousers. I actually went to get a black suit and they didn't have any black jackets, like the blazers. So I just got the trousers and then they had some gorgeous blue ones in that I absolutely loved. And then I was like, oh no, I've already got the suit, the trousers, the blouse, and then I got a white blouse which needs to be exchanged because it's got makeup on it. And then they've got the the dress, you know, the, the suit dress. And I was thinking, should I get that? Because it it's nice, so I might get it just to try it. And then I also spent £200 at ASOS, even though one of my orders haven't turned up. And it should have come Monday and it's Wednesday and I keep contacting ASOS and I'm just getting nowhere so I bought some leather flat shoes that I don't love but I've worn every day the leather on the outside but on the inside they're not so my feet have been sweating so I've put some insoles in so the bottom doesn't sweat but the top still does but they're comfy it was like they were made for me and then I bought these shiny patent ones with a, a material bowl detail but there was some glue on them so I've sent them back and reordered them and that's what's not come I've also bought some sling back heels I think the heels are about a three and a half inch and the silver by faith I've bought them they are nice they were half price and that's why I picked them up because I thought I'm not gonna wear them often but because they're half price I thought I can justify them I also bought a navy cardigan I wore it last week. I don't know if I filmed myself with it on, but I had um, my yellow blouse on with it, and it looked nice. I was actually going to wear it today with my light blue blouse, and I'm not happy about this because I washed the blouse, and basically it shrunk, so it just about was the right length, and now it's too short. So I'm probably going to put that on eBay and probably get next to nothing for it which I'm not happy about because it's a nice blue blouse but it it was, to be honest, it was cheap and but I got some of the similar quality from Asda, the yellow one actually the yellow one was either 12, 10 or 12 pounds and it's washed better than that blue one so I'm just going to have to sell the blue one and buy a blue blouse but hopefully long sleeve because that's why I was wearing the cardigan because obviously I don't like my arms what else did I buy? 
I bought some My Little Pony pyjamas in my size and they sent extra small. Surprisingly, I can get the shorts on. They're not too tight but the small would fit better and I'm not a small. A small's like an 8. 10 is um, a medium. Well, 10, 12 is a medium, 14 to 16 is a large. So I wanted to like, obviously I didn't get the top on but I didn't even try but the shorts in small surprisingly fit, work tight but the, the next size up would have fit better and I'm thinking why are these fitting me? Anyway I'm sending them back completely because I do love them but <clears throat> they're actually sold out in the size I want now. So I got them. I think that's what I got in my first order and then the order I ordered the other day I reordered the shoes because I've sent the ones with glue back and what else did I order? It was over a hundred pounds so I can't remember what I ordered. I don't have a clue what I ordered. That's really bad. I know I ordered the shoes again. I may have ordered another pair of shoes. That's quite possible that I've ordered another pair of shoes as well. But I can't for the life of me think what I've actually bought. So I'm going to stop this video and have a look and I'll, re I'll start filming again straight away. I don't know why I'm so talkative. I'm tired. But I'm too hot at the same time. Head's pounding. Can't remember when I last took painkillers. I just feel like crap and I should be sleeping.